John Lewis the third um, is a African American uh, behavioral prevention specialist slash urban farmer. Um, John was from Roanoke, but he was going, he went to VCU and ended up working for Richmond Behavior and Health Authority um, as, a, as a behavior prevention specialist. Basically, his charge was to try to keep kids from doing bad in school, right? uh, or, or acting out bad behaviors in school and in life in general. Um, I met John in 2012. Um, me and John, John was already in schools working with young people in gardens. I think he worked, he worked at a GH Reed Elementary School, which is here in uh, Southside Richmond. Um, and he had started working on a, gar uh, a, a, a one acre farm called Jerusalem Connection, which is off, which was off of Midlow Green Turnpike. Uh, so when I met him, he already had a body of work. Um, I had just started McDonough Community Garden, was the first community garden I had uh, that we started. I was in 2012. We were at an event together and it was like a banquet style dinner to see Will Allen. Will Allen is a uh, pioneer in urban agriculture, black urban agriculture uh, from out of Wisconsin or Milwaukee. Uh, so anyway, um, I'm in line trying to get some food. Go, you know, hear Will Allen speak and John is standing in line in front of me. So I'm like, yo, hey, what's going on? How you doing? I'm Brian. You know, good to meet you. You know, glad to you know, see some other brown faces here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And we just started talking. And uh, John was like, yeah, you know, did you hear about this grant? I can't remember what grant it was. It's, it doesn't even matter. Uh, and I coached the conversation. And he was like, yo, man, um, are you going to apply? And I was like, yeah, I was. I was gonna probably apply. He's like, yeah, I was gonna apply too. And you know, he was like, yo, man, it's crazy, man. We shouldn't be competing with each other for these grants. And that was like our first conversation. Like, we eating, we getting ready to eat, and we talking about this grant. And we're like, yo, you know, two black brothers out here doing garden and work shouldn't have to be pitted against each other to try to get some funding. So we decided to like join forces. You know. And so 2012, he already had a nonprofit organization up. I was already doing